Hey guys, C Trauma Invasion here and welcome back to a new video. First of all, I have a sore throat and came down with a really bad fever this week, so if my voice is off, that's why. But in episode 39 of my C Drama news videos, I asked you if you wanted to see a Youth With You Scandal Explained video and why it became cancelled. So a lot of you said that you wanted a video on it, so here it is. If you haven't seen my other Scandals Explained video, I'll leave a playlist and also an info card or annotated card for you to click on after this video to catch up on my other videos. Make sure to subscribe and let's just jump on into it. On May 8th, the Youth With You officially announced that their finale episode will be cancelled since the milk scandal or the food wastage scandal. What happened was there were multiple videos going around the internet that showed a lot of beverages such as new bottles of milk, tons and tons of them. I think there was thousands that were just being dumped down the drain. What this has to do with the show is that on other idol competitions as well, the audience is asked to vote through text messages and most of these shows are sponsored by dairy brands or milk brands. So if you would buy milk, then it would count as one vote. They would scan the QR codes of milk or yogurt. Therefore, if you guys know anything about fandom culture in general, people went crazy over this and milk voting turned into a million dollar industry. Many fans club would raise money to buy milk in bulk. So this would go anywhere from hundreds to thousands of milk being bought per day. They would all put their monies together and then would buy the maximum amount that they can with the numbers of votes. They're allowed to vote a day. So as you can imagine, this would accumulate to a lot and a lot of milk, especially when programs such as Youth With You would go on for weeks and weeks. For example, the Tencent Idol show Chuang 2020 last year, the top contestants received votes that were at least 48 million yuan or 7.4 million dollars of yogurt. Style voting. Chinese outlet Southern Weekly reported it's hard to trace where the milk goes after the votes are cast. On social media, sometimes there are photos of fans drinking the milk themselves to the point that they even get sick and end up in the hospital. Other people just give it away to their friends after the voting thing is over. While others sell it at really, really low prices, like a dollar. Or some fan groups end up donating the drinks to charities. However, this isn't the case with Youth With You 3. As I've mentioned in the beginning, there was a video that circulated last month with Youth With You staff members throwing it on site behind the scenes of the competition. What made it disturbing was that the people showed in the video was sitting behind like a wall full of boxes that contain yogurts and dairy drinks. After this, a lot of politicians and also people who were a part of the anti-food waste campaign spoke up about the matter saying that this is seeking profit and attention through waste and a lack of respect for labor for all of the hard work put in to making these products. Hours after this comment was made, it was believed that the government ordered Youth With You 3 to be postponed or cancelled. And as you've known by now, there unfortunately is no winner for the third season. I feel really bad for fans and also the contestants on the show. Especially since they all worked really hard, put a lot of time and effort into practicing and wanting to debut in the competition. I also searched up a bunch of articles who interviewed some of the people that was in the fandom. So Wiki Sue, a 26-year-old viewer and fan of Youth With You 3 who lived in Hong Kong, said that she's been casting votes every day in the past few months of the show. She's been sending money to the fan group who would take photos of the QR code after buying the milk packages. She said after seeing the scandal, she was shocked as well. 
and didn't know where the milk exactly goes, but she would buy them through the mass fan groups as well. She shares her opinion, saying that she believes that wasting milk is very wrong, but at the same time, she understood why the program needs the sponsors to continue running. She says these types of idol contests are made to be a money battle. As a fan, I don't want to get involved in boosting traffic, data, or milk voting at all. But this is the only way to make sure that the contestant that I like has a chance of getting noticed. The more money the idol makes, the more chances that this person will end up winning. It's unfortunately just how the industry works. And it gets increasingly competitive every time. The thing is, as long as final competition votes are based on online votes, overconsumption will probably not change. We also got an official statement from the sponsor that sponsored this milk and dairy products called Mengyu Dairy. They posted an official apology on Weibo, saying they fully support the measures taken by Aichi and that they are against the form of food waste as well. So they'll be looking into this and working with the government to change and improve on how these shows can become better. Although it was mainly the milk controversy that ended these shows run, there was also another big scandal involving one of the contestants, Tony Yu. He is quite popular on Youth With You 3, but unfortunately, netizens dug up on his past and said that his parents used to run a KTV, which involved a lot of illegal services, similar to the Burning Sun scandal. I'm most likely going to get demonetized if I say all the allegations here, so you can quickly type it up on Google and you'll see what I'm talking about. Anyways, there was just a lot of scandals revolving around this season of Youth With You 3, but mainly the issue was the milk wastage scandal. I think one of the worst parts was that it wasn't just the milk, there was cut up bottles and plastic waste that was dumped into the drainage as well. The entire situation is just really messed up and really sad for the contestants involved. But overall, I think it's better that this is clarified now than later on. And they could have sent it out to charities, but unfortunately, it's not the case. There's just so many people suffering and it's just so sad and also ignorant to see so many people dump perfectly drinkable milk into the drainage. As for the future of Youth With You and other idol survival competition shows, rumors are that the new seasons will be postponed next year until they figure out how to balance out the sponsorships or work in new ways where it doesn't involve food wastage. And that basically covers it. If you like these types of videos, make sure to subscribe and turn on notification bell to all so you don't miss out on future uploads. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye.